Welcome to Post Around the House. In this video, I'm going to show you a quick tip when prepping a wall for plaster. So if you've got a hole like this one here, and it's only small, but it's got a bit of a void behind it. And something like bonding plaster is just likely to keep falling in the gap, and you don't really want to be packing and packing and packing the stuff. And my quick tip is to use a bit of expanding foam. And so all we do with this is start by spraying it around the edges there first, so it bonds with all the four edges we're going into. And then it will start to grip to itself and fill that hole. Then when it expands, it will come out a bit and we can just cut that back later and that will be perfect for plastering with a skim coat. Now I'm using gun grade foam with a gun because I find this a lot more controllable. You could try it without the gun, but I find that fires the foam out a bit too quickly, but that's entirely up to you. So as you can see there now, I've put enough foam in that it's expanding out, and that might look a bit of a mess at the moment, but as long as we don't play with it now, we'll be able to trim that off, that will come away from the timber and the wall. So it's a few days later, we're ready to plaster, and all you've got to do is cut back this foam using a plasterboard saw, a knife, or a sharp trowel like this. This is what I'm going to use. When I did that, I just made sure that I trimmed the expanded foam just below the surface so that it gives us some room to get some plaster in. The next thing to do is when you're prepping your wall and you're putting PVA on the wall, just go over the top just like you would the rest of the wall with your PVA like that. Just in case you don't know, I'm just using PVA like this and this is mixed down in a ratio of one part PVA to three parts water. And this is something I always do, I put it all over the wall, I usually do two coats before putting on my skim coat. And then, as I always do when plastering, I leave my final coat of PVA just to go off until it's slightly tacky, and then I can apply my final skim coat of multi-finish plaster. And that's it, simple. So if you found that video useful, then please give it a like, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel, and press the bell icon for regular notifications. I've been Pouse Around the House. Ta-ta, farewell.